Hello guys, welcome to PS Motors and today we will be having a glance at the all new Honda City. Let's get started. This is the car key you guys, it gets lock, unlock and both release options. The car is already unlocked. So now let's have a closer look at this car. This is the front profile you guys, it is a huge step up from the previous generation. Here it gets full LED headlamps including fog lamps with DRL and the radiator grill which is really elegant, fully changes the game and it is fully different from the previous generation. From the side the car really looks gorgeous and elongated it's again a step up from the previous generation it gets a hell lot of character lines which uplifts the car and makes it more elegant now let's have a look at the rear profile of this vehicle which is fully different and fully changed from the previous generation this car gets parking sensors and a rear camera including reflectors at the bottom of the rear bumper these tail lamps are fully LED lights which kind of reminds me of the BMW 3 series. Comment down and let me know what you think. So now let's hop in starting with the front interior. This is the driver's side door. This is the pull lever in chrome. These are the window and ORBM controls. At the bottom it gets a bottle holder. This is the tweeter and this is the gorgeous interior of this Honda City 2021. Getting in, this is the beautiful leather wrapped steering wheel. This is the semi-digital instrument cluster. And on the steering wheel, it gets the control for media on the left side. And on the right side, it gets the control for the cruise system of this vehicle. On the dash, there you get the push start button. And on the right side again, it gets the control for the light options. I mean the light controls and the watch, lane watch assist, which is provided by Honda. The steering wheel is equipped with both tilt and telescopic adjustments and on the right side it gets the wiper controls. Moving on, this is the beautiful touchscreen infotainment system which supports Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. These are the AC controls and at the bottom you get a space to keep your mobile phone including two USB sockets and a 12 volt socket. There you get a two cup holders, this is the gear lever and this is the handbrake. This is the openable armrest which is more or less deep in and it's pretty usable. Moving on, the dashboard gets a wooden trim at the center which elegates the look and the dashboard is fully changed in design from previous generation. And this is the glove box which is pretty usable. Moving up. we get the auto dimming rear view mirror and these are the ceiling lamps including the sunroof controls this is the sunroof and we get the sun visors including vanity mirrors for the passenger as well as for the driver side we'll have a look in a few seconds there you go this is the driver side vanity mirror included in the sun visor so now let's hop in in the rear side of this car this is the place where the owners will spend most of their time this is the pull lever this is the window control grab handle and the button holder and this is the spacious interior of this car including AC vents for the rear passengers at the bottom two 12 volt power sockets and moving on we get to see full leather interiors and these are the ceiling lamps with an up armrest with two cup holders it gets three individual headrests for extra comfort and the rear windshield also gets a sunshade so now let's have a look 
at the engine bay, shall we? 